Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is day eight, uh, nine of the Lead Code Daily Challenge. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's farm. Today's farm is 142, uh, linked list psycho 2. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about this farm. I don't know why we said that. I don't know. I feel like I'm repeating myself. All right, so I mean, this is a way. Um, this is a very ridiculously hard farm, to be frank, uh, if you ask me. Uh, it's listed as a medium now, but it's one of those things where there, it is you have to have seen it before, kind of, or at least like partially, right? And the idea here is um, there's a couple of things. There's like Freud's algorithm. I think it's called Freud's algorithm. I mean, I feel like Freud has like a couple of algorithms, so... It may be a little bit confusing, but I think maybe it's just called psycho detection, which is, you know, uh, you could Google it, it'll be fine. There's also like Todoist and the hair algorithm or something like this. Um, basically, the idea is that you have two pointers and then to detect whether there is a psycho, um, uh, you have a, 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 I don't know, uh, you have a hair, which is a fast hopper uh, that hops two step at once and then you have a slower one that hops once at once and then basically uh if they catch up that means that what does that mean right that means that well there's a cycle because the fast one would have you eventually catch up and of course if the fast pointer leaves the uh leaves the uh, uh linked list then it will be you know well out of the linked list right um, I think I I actually vaguely remember doing a really long video on this, uh, and I don't remember if I did a good job of it. But I did remember I did have a lot of visualization about finding the first pointer in which this is the case, and and to be honest, it's kind of like eh, I don't I don't know if I, I I don't know if I want to say that this is one of those uh, things where. I don't know if this is one of those things where, where, um, where you just kind of memorize a little bit. But let's actually—I mean, or not memorize, but uh, I feel like I've done it so many times that like I just know the answer. But but the proof is always a little bit tricky to understand. Um, but we, let's do the um, let's do the binary one first. And what I mean by that is that. So I'm just looking at what this is saying. Okay, maybe, yeah, okay. We still just return the list, right? Okay, yeah. So I'm going to just do the binary one first. And what I mean by that is that whether it's true or false, and then we'll, we'll talk about how to do the math to calculate the other one. I never really remember it, but we'll see, right? So fast is equal to head, tail, or slow is equal to head. And then while fast is not none, I don't actually remember quite the cleanest way to write this. And also, I guess the way... Um, uh, do I start at the beginning or the, the, the fake pointer, right? I always forget. Or like, I, I don't always know which one is better, but... Right? Because the idea is that we want to manipulate only the dot next and not the current. Because if fast get, gets to none, then we lose some information, right? Uh, well, I mean, if it gets to none, I guess it's fine. Because then now we know it's none. But but mm, I guess it's fine either way for this particular problem. Because we're not doing any manipulation of uh, things. And if they're equal, then it should be fine. But I guess, you know, why not just be consistent about it? It's not none, fast is equal to fast dot next. And then slow is equal to slow dot next. And by definition, this cannot be none just because it is slower than one of the fast, right? So then if. Oh, wait. Um, and then I think also and fast is not equal to slow, I suppose. If fast is. Oh, uh, yeah. If fast dot next is none, then we just return. Uh, none Oops. because that means that we've reached the end of the uh, thingy right otherwise that means that they're equal and what does that mean when they're equal right hmm 
Uh, the proof of this is always a little bit tricky, but... But basically, let me draw it out real quick. Sorry, let me let me get my pens and stuff, and also put, remember to put it on screen this time. I feel like I've forgotten before. Um, okay, so the idea is that so the idea is that oops, so that you know you have some linked lists, right? Uh, and then there is some psycho, as presumably because we always solved the other case, right? And then basically the idea is that um, the idea is that I'm changing colors. Hang on, that there is some fast bunny that goes twice, and then it goes once. And then, you know, uh, let me just simulate this manually. Do, do, and then, do, and then, do, do. Oops, that's not quite right. Wow, that is just lazy. Do, do, and then this goes here. And then finally, uh, uh, maybe not yet. I don't remember when the condition is. Maybe one more then. Um, but because of the pigeonhole principle, it will kind of uh, do, do. And then so it matches up here, right? And then the idea is, and then now we figure out that, okay, it's caught up here. It turns out that, and this is kind of, how do I explain this in a good way? It turns out that basically, um, To be honest, like I mean, I could visualize it obviously, but I feel like I'm I'm sorry I'm taking my time a little bit because I am struggling to explain this a little bit. Um, because what I want to be honest and fair with you at home is that I don't want to be like, oh, I know the answer, so let me prove the answer knowing the answer, right? That's kind of like, I mean, it maybe it's good enough if you just want to memorize if you want to memorize maybe you know you could just look at a lot of channels i mean anyway uh because i've done you know uh, uh, there are a lot of this is not a a, a way of uh, but i'm trying to think from first principle how do i arrive like i'm trying to pretend i don't know the answer and then in that case how do i derive the current state to the answer and then generalize it right Hope that's a fair thing, um, and you know, and to be honest, I mean, you could probably skip ahead if, if this is not what you're interested in, because I mean, I'd probably go the answer in the future, and you know, I'm just trying to figure out this out as myself, and, and every video I do uh, every day is live, and that includes both the coding and also the explanation, so sometimes it's going to be a little choppy, and hope you understand, but, I, but my, my hope is that, uh, you know, you see that you know, even someone who is experienced in both programming and competitive programming and all this stuff uh, will struggle to explain some stuff and just understanding some stuff in general. So let me try to think, right? <clears throat> if we want to... Okay, let's, let's give some wearable names, right? And also new colors. Let's just say, you know, the beginning is A, right? Some A. Um, by definition... The, the the red one, the slow one, will complete before one cycle, right? So let's just say the cycle length. Or maybe we could even do it another way. Let's just say here to where they meet is B. And then... And... Yeah, and... Eh, okay, this is C then, right? Fine. Um, so then the first... The slower bunny traveled A plus B where the fast, uh, I guess, slower turtle, not slower bunny. And then the faster uh, bunny goes A plus B plus C plus B, right? Yeah. And where they meet is going to... So th it means that, in a way... I don't think I'm exploring this well at all. 
or like I, I don't think I'm understanding it well today, because uh, you know, uh, my goal with these is also that I don't really uh, you know. So if I don't know how to solve this, how how would I solve this? Hmm. So then, um, but these two things are kind of equal, I guess, but not really. Hmm. How do I say this? So, oh, oh, sorry, sorry, yeah, yeah. So they're not equal, but because A plus B uh, times 2, I guess, is equal to A plus B plus C plus B, right? I forgot the times 2 part. That, uh, I think I got confused. Because this is moving at half a step, right? And then, of course, now you can subtract out one of these, right? Uh, and then you have A plus B. B is equal to C plus B, and then of course the B also deletes, so then A is equal to C. So in, this is how you figure out that um, this length A is equal to C. Wow, I'm really bad at arithmetic. This should not have taken that hard, uh, that long actually, to be honest. But okay, so then, so then now, let's just say we are we are given A and B. Um, so the kind of the really cool way, I mean. So the less cool way, I suppose, is that, I mean, yeah, the less cool way, what would be the less cool way to do it? The less cool way to do it is that, um, hmm, what is the less cool way to do it? I don't know if I know the less cool way to do it. This problem is hard. Like, I mean, I know how to do it, <laughs> I'm not going to lie. But this problem seems hard. Like I don't even know what, what's the like less cool, naive way of doing this. Like if we just kind of do it. Eh, I don't know. But the cool way of doing it, I suppose. And I don't even know how to get here without knowing it. But I just know it. And like, like I said, this is kind of ridiculous. But knowing that you have distance a away and c away, that means that given the point that we meet, we met the uh, uh, the turtle and the the uh, the, the rabbit. Um, we can just keep on moving. Uh, we start because A is equal to C. We start another pointer back here, and then we just move one at a time until we meet here because A is equal to C. That's basically the idea. Uh, I try to think whether there's a way to kind of, you know, uh, um, no, I, I have to get this off before I forget. I'm trying to figure a way if there's a. I don't know. I don't know if I did a good job of. Um, I don't know if I did a good job of uh, of kind of proving it from first principles. I don't think so, to be honest. But hopefully, at least the visualization helped a bit. So yeah. So now we do slow as you go to new head. Done next, maybe. Uh, where do we? I think this is a little bit off. I think we want just to be consistent with how we've been treating it. I think we want this, and therefore here, now the next pointer is going to be. The one that's matching so then now we want new head dot next i think maybe i'm wrong on this one i think i overthink this a little bit too much and then now it's like a little bit weird so yeah so wow snow snow dot next is not equal to fast dot next next is equal to slow dot oops slow is equal to slow dot next fast equal to fast dot next and then while they're equal then we just return snow dot next i think that's it in my infinite loop <laughs> because I maybe it's just off by one. Uh, hmm. Yeah, what? Is that a this or this? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Um, hmm. Am I consider? No, this one got. got oh, well, this one is just whatever. Huh. That's an awkward thing. This is, I don't know, what, what is this input again? Oh, this isn't, th there's no cycle. Oh, because here, now the Yiko Yichu. Wow, so this does nothing because I, I actually made a mistake because this is always true. 
Oh, this is always four. Oh, so this does nothing. Whoops. Wow, I'm like really bad today, isn't it? <laughs> okay, let's just start this as that next. Yeah, maybe. Uh, wow, did it, and then now just never, never. Uh, how do I do? I mean, I guess here, fine. Uh, I, I didn't. I, I didn't wanted to do it cool, but I. I think maybe this is fine. Uh, 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 but I thought this looks a little bit yuckier. That's why I didn't do it that way. But yeah, uh, okay. Uh, and then it turns out that everything is mostly okay then. So I, I just kind of got <laughs> a little bit sloppy. Uh, oh yeah, let's give it a quick submit and hopefully this is right. Yes, right on the first try. 1073 day streak. Uh, yeah. Mm, that's all I have for today. Let me know what you think. And yeah, stay good, stay healthy, take good mental health. I'll see y'all later and take care. Bye-bye.